America's newest nuclear stealth bomber made its debut Friday after years of secret development and is part of the Pentagon's answer to rising concerns over a future conflict with China. The B-21 Raider is the first new American bomber aircraft in more than 30 years, almost every aspect of the program is classified. As evening fell over the Air Force's Plant 42 in Palmdale, the public got its first glimpse of the Raider in a tightly controlled ceremony. It started with a flyover of the three bombers still in service, the B-52 Stratofortress, the B-1 Lancer and the B-2 Spirit. Then the hangar doors slowly opened and the B-21 was towed partially out of the building. This isn't just another airplane, Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin said. It's the embodiment of America's determination to defend the republic that we all love. The B-21 is part of the Pentagon's efforts to modernize all three legs of its nuclear triad, which includes silo-launched nuclear ballistic missiles and submarine-launched warheads, as it shifts from the counter-terrorism campaigns of recent decades to meet China's rapid military modernization. The Northrop Grumman B-21 Raider is an American strategic bomber under development for the United States Air Force USAF, by Northrop Grumman. As part of the Long Range Strike Bomber LRSB, program, it is to be a long-range, stealth intercontinental strategic bomber for the USAF able to deliver conventional and thermonuclear weapons. 1, 2, 3. The Air Force is planning to replace the Rockwell B-1 Lancer and Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit with the B-21 by 2040, and could possibly replace the Boeing B-52 Stratofortress after that. 4. The Air Force began planning for the B-21 in 2011, 5, and awarded the major development contract in 2015. 6. The B-21 is expected to make its first flight in 2023 and enter service by 2027. 7, 8. Many aspects of the B-21 program are highly classified. The program is designated as a special access program. 4. The Congressional Research Service noted in 2021 that the B-21's technical details and specifications, such as speed, enabling systems, size, required stealth, structure, number and type of engines, projected weapons, and onboard sensors remain classified, although some information about various other aspects of the program have been made public since 2015. 4. The first photos of the aircraft were released on 2 December 2022, taken during a rollout ceremony at Northrop Grumman's production facilities in Palmdale, California. The classified long-range strike bomber LRSB, program began in 2011, 5, and the Air Force issued a request for proposal to develop a LRSB aircraft in July 2014. 5. 9. A development contract was awarded to Northrop Grumman in October 2015. 6. Boeing and Lockheed Martin, who submitted losing bids for the project, filed bid protests. 10. In October 2016, the Government Accountability Office GAO rejected the challenges and sustained the USAF's decision to award the LRSB contract to Northrop Grumman. The GAO report revealed that cost was the deciding factor in selecting Northrop Grumman over the Boeing Lockheed Martin team. Management and acquisition of the B-21 program is being overseen by the Air Force Rapid Capabilities.